Good morning. Today we're going to be going through the process of attaching and viewing documents within the permit program. Depending on which department you're looking for records in, you can either go to My Records and you'll see your records. But if you make submittals within multiple departments, you can also click on just the department to get to your records. So for this one, we're going to be using a planning record today. So I clicked on planning and then I'm going to click on the red job number. Once it opens, you're going to go here to record information to the drop down and you'll see attachments. At this point, you can view which documents are already in here. And you can see that there's multiple pages of documents. So if the city informed you that you have a document in there, you can click on any of these to open the document that you want to view. So depending on how your browser works and where the document opens, you can see on this one, I clicked on the record and the document was up in the right hand corner. Um, actually, that went away from my screen, but there's the drop down right over here where you can open your documents and then you can click on the document and open it to view whatever has been attached. But in this case, we're going to be adding a document. So you're going to click on add. You're going to click add again. And in this case, it defaulted to the document that I need. I'm going to click on the document and click on open. As you can see in this area right here, it has attached the document that I need. If I needed to add another document, you could click on add. Or you can do, if you had multiple documents, you can do them all at the same time. Now that I've attached my documents, I'm going to go to continue. Down here, you can see it's attached two different documents for me. If I discover in this process that I've made an error, I can click on remove and remove the document I don't want. But now I have to name the documents that I've attached. This process is really important as all of attachments go into one folder. So how you name the document makes it easier for us to locate what you're attaching. In this case, I have attached um, a site plan. So you have options in here that you can use for what you're attaching. This is an exhibit. I'm going to click on exhibit. And if this was plan check one or two, just to make it easier for myself and the public or and the city staff, public, whoever's going to be viewing this, I'm going to put PC1 and I'm going to call it a site plan. Then I'm going to go to the next document and let's say this is my response letter. I'm going to call it resubmittal responses PC1 and I'm going to name this response. Then you're, I'm going to click on save. Now you can see that the documents that you just attached now show in the record and you have completed the process of attaching the documents. City staff is notified once documents are attached. Um, so there's nothing else that you need to do. All of your documents are ready to go within the system. If you do have any other questions after doing this, please contact um, your permit tech for that's working on your record or whoever you've been dealing with specifically in that department. Thank you.